then I think we get to go back and, oh my god, I almost went overboard. That would have been good. Boat guy here back at you. We're on the Lake Washington Ship Canal to introduce part two. That's right, part two. We have two episodes to our tugboat series. This one's super exciting. No charge for the second one. So we got done, we, we left the railroad uh, pier, and this is a Canadian company. They radioed and said, hey, we need help spinning a barge in the Duwamish River. Uh, Russell said, you know, the tugboat business is kind of like the tow truck business, that basically they're on the tug all day, people call up and say they need some help. The length of this barge was just enough to get it turned into Duwamish. We help them do that, they take off, and Sam and I, who don't know a squad about tugboats, um, Noticed that the guy was going really fast and seemed kind of out of control. It turns out that this barge now is careening towards a series of boat houses and a bridge. All of a sudden, we feel our tug, the engines, RPM come up, two guys come to the bow with, with lines, they get up on the barge, they get lines on the barge, and they start pulling that thing as hard as they can away from those boat houses. We didn't know what was happening at the time but we could sense that it was pretty urgent. We are just rolling. I mean, I thought everything would be slow and easy. It's not, it's standing on the gas. It turns out that that barge was out of control and had we not been there to get a line on the back of it and get it pulled away, that barge would have careened into a bunch of houseboats and pilings. It would have been a big mess. Hey, we're just pulling into the barge here. There's the West Track 2 that was working with us all morning. Hey, if you're a boat guy, it doesn't get any better than spending the morning on the tug in Elliott Bay. This has been a great day. 